Hello, I'm Achila, Developer Relations Lead at Crab Nebula. And today I'm excited to show to you the Crab Nebula DevTools Premium. So if you look at my screen, this is a typical Tauri app, but it has the Tauri plugin DevTools installed, which is the plugin that enables Crab Nebula DevTools. So now if I right click, I have the dialog for opening the DevTools. And if I click on this, it's going to access my keychain and then it's going to load the Crab Nebula DevTools in the drawer. Pretty much the same as in a web browser if you're using the DevTools. So with this, we have all the typical events being logged. So if I get out with my mouse or enter, it's going to trigger some events here. We can look at our source files. So I can investigate, for example, the source for my Tauri config. I can check my cargo toml and so on. We can go talking about the config. We can go straight into my config and investigate how it looks like and check all the schema and what was set, what was not. But more specifically, if I go to the calls tab and let's say we need to profile or debug some weird request. So in this case, I'm going to fire this request and I can filter it over here and see that my command flacky request has been fired. And then if I click here, I can see all the log and the details and so on. But as you can see, there's a lot of stuff to read and it's hard to do that in the drawer sometimes. So we can click here to detach it. And then I have my dev tools on a separate window in the same way as before. And then if we investigate on the logs, we can see that we have some tracing events being fired from my source code. So I can click on it and it goes exactly to the place in my source tab where this debug has been defined. So then we can actually debug our source code and investigate when things are going wrong. Uh, and once I'm done, I can come back to the usual drawer experience and go on experiencing my app. But if that's not your cup of tea, we can also use it as a standalone Tauri app. So Dev, Crab Nebula DevTools has two modes, the embed mode and the standalone. In the standalone mode, we have my Tauri app here working independently, and we have the Crab Nebula DevTools as a separate Tauri app. So in this case, once it is uh, connected to the cloud, I can just come here and paste the port in which my app, my Tauri plugin DevTools is putting my instrumentation server. And once I click connect, I get the exact same experience that I was having in the integrated web view. So in this case, I have all this stuff that I, that I would expect before. Uh, if I send my flaky request here again, we can still see it. We can still see it going. And once it comes back, I can then once more check everything that's happening. I can check my, my tracing information and so on. Exactly the same as before. So you can go back and forth in which one of these versions you prefer when you have Crab Nebula DevTools installed. So I hope you have found this interesting. Find us in the Crab Nebula Discord and I'm happy to listen to every feedback you have, feature requests and hear about your experience using this app. See you soon.